What's up with y'all boys, man? This is the Big Guard University bill. This probably my second favorite bill behind Jamal with the nine. I can't lie to you. In these clips, I'm only at 86 overall, by the way. This build is not maxed out, but I had to get y'all some gameplay, you feel me? Comment down below an NBA player comparison for this build. Just based off of these clips at the beginning, who in the NBA would you compare this player to? But yeah, this build can, is an elite score on all three levels. And even if you get shut down, you have an 85 post control and an 84 strength. So you still gonna be able to get your buckets regardless. You gonna be able to grit and grind your buckets too on this player. And it also has defense, my brother. Make sure y'all hit that like button if y'all wanna see gameplay on this build, more gameplay on this build. And yeah, let's get straight into it. Go! Like I said, this is a big guard academy, big guard university build right here, man. You feel me? So I went 6'6". Six, six. I, I, I had been wanting to make another 6'6 six, six for the longest too. So I decided I'm gonna go make a big a big guard 6'6 six, six. and I also might make like a more so metal guard because the only other 6'6 six, six I got is my first guard build and then I got the pure playmaker but that's on a whole nother account that I can't even get access to right now. And as you can see here go all the stats. No dunk, even though it's called a two-way slash and playmaker, I don't put I didn't put no dunk on this player. Y'all know how I get down, bro. This is a skill B. You can't just run to the goal and press square on this player. You kinda can, but you can't at the same time. You feel me? Post control. Now this build was inspired by Dimeworks uh bully guard bill, bully point bill that he made. But he his build like six eight or something like that. But look, like I said, this was inspired by his build. But I had to put my own little twist on it, you feel me? Now, like I said, 6'6", 85 layer, 85 post control, 92 mid-range. Get that Hall of Fame uh, medium magician. I could, low key could have went to a 93 and got Hall of Fame catch and shoot, but I'd be, I would, I'm cool with having it go, you feel me? 77.3, now I could have went with a 78 or 80 or 85, 83. I could have did that. I wanted this name. I wanted two-way slash and playmaker because I think if I go up, it's gonna call me a two-way, three-level playmaker or something like that. And I mean, that's cool, but I wanted a unique name that you really don't see like that, you feel me? So I went with the 77.3 instead of the 78 or higher. 99 free throw, 92 ball handle with an 89 pass. You can't be a, P bro, if you're making PGs, if you're making point guard bills with low pass or low ball handle, what are you doing? 83 speed ball to get that gold speed booster. Uh, down to the defense, we got the 88 perimeter defense to get that. Well, it gets you a couple back. 88 gets you gold, 94 feet. 87 gets you gold challenger. And then I think 86 gets you gold workhorse. And 85 gets you silver clamps. So, you know what I'm saying? You can choose between 88 and 85. I just went with 88. And then also, once you get to 87, that's when it starts calling you a two-way. So if you don't want to be called a two-way, you can drop it below 87. And it'll just call you a slash and playmaker. 72 steal. I don't really be sp spamming the steal, but like that, I want to play real straight up defense on people. I don't want to get bailed out by no steals, you feel me? It's been a recent trend that I've been doing on my last couple players, and that's been going with a lower steal and having a higher perimeter because I want to be able to just body somebody up, really put them in a box, you feel me? 86 speed just to, to get that um gold speed booster and get that gold hyper drive 73 acceleration i wish i could have went, went a little bit higher i wish i could have went to like a 77 78 80. i would have loved to have like an 83 to get that gold blow by but we also we do get hall of fame physical handles so it kind of helps that i don't have you know gold blow by because I got Hall of Fame physical handles, so I can still move people out my way. And speaking of physical handles, with the 84 strength, you get that. You get Silver Bulldozer. You get your Fearless Finisher up. You get your Clamps up. You need Because you need strength to get them badges anyway. You know what I'm saying? Silver Brick Wall. I didn't even realize I had could get that. Silver and a movable Enforcer alongside Silver Clamps is already, you know that's going to be elite. Once I get my defense up, a 56 vertical, I didn't touch that. And then a 99 stamina. I, I probably didn't have to go with a 99, but why not? You know what I'm saying? Just just to have it, you feel me? And then once you get out of this, they're going to call you a two-way slashing playmaker. The OG name. 
if y'all enjoyed the video if y'all want more if y'all ready for me to drop gameplay on this video go ahead and hit that like button try to get 10 likes on the video no money spent um every badge in the build game build <laughs> every badge in the game build it's still on the way i'm gonna live stream it i might do it on twitch or something i just might just let y'all know matter of fact if you made it this far follow my twitch link will be in the, the description go on and follow me on twitch just in case i do decide to stream on twitch i might just stream on youtube i don't know but yeah hit that like button hit that subscribe button roll to 37 billion subscribers and i'll see y'all in the next one